today is a sad day and one that goes against everything my car hoarding instincts stand for because today I'm saying goodbye to one of my cars. Bye bye MR2. There's a lot of rust. You want to see the rust on the other side? Come this side. There's a lot of rust there. Oh, goodbye car. Yep, I only introduced the MR2 a few days ago on the last video, but something else has turned up and I couldn't really say no. So because I'm a bit limited to space, I've got five parking spaces and seven cars at the moment. Something had to go. I put this and the Rover Tomcat on eBay, only this sold. So um, yeah, it's probably for the best, let's be honest. It's still got hours and hours and hours, literally hundreds of hours of welding left to do. The front suspension probably needs a rebuild and it's never going to be the tidiest car in the world, even after several thousand pounds worth of work and for that kind of money I could go and buy a tidy car. Admittedly it wouldn't be my car, but it would maybe be better, it might be a better car. But this is going to a new owner who's very enthusiastic. This is another car that arrived to me by accident. I joked with a friend that I really wanted this car. He put it in storage for a while, then he ran out of storage and uh, ran me up and offered to me again. And he said yes, by the time I got home from work, it was on my drive and the keys were through the letterbox. So I owned a Toyota MR2. Um, I had to do a bit of work to get the MOT, obviously, um, but I used it for two years. I track dated it, which is enormous fun. However, eventually the rust got too bad for the MOT to put it through anymore. So I wound up having the entire driver's side welded under the floor, the sill, the rear arch, the rear inner arch, and the rear back corner. Um, it has got uh, SPAC suspension on it, so it's lowered and that helps with handling. It's got a nice set of Unirail tyres on it and a Mongo stainless exhaust system. The guy who's bought this car for me has had an absolute steal. The parts alone are worth probably four times what he's paid for it. So uh, yeah, I really hope he has a good, good fun with it.